Role of neuro interventions in treatment of brain aneurysms. What are aneurysms? Aneurysms are abnormal balloon like projections from the normal arterial wall. So, like an over inflated balloon, these aneurysms have very thin wall and after a period of time, they have a tendency to rupture and cause bleeding within the brain, which can threaten the life. So, there are various treatment modalities that are available for treatment of aneurysms which includes endovascular methods or open surgery and clipping of the aneurysms. Among the endovascular methods, the most common method that is used is called coiling of the aneurysm, where a tube is taken close to the aneurysm and the aneurysm is filled with soft platinum coils which mechanically occupies the space and promotes clotting of the blood within the aneurysm, thereby preventing the blood flow into the aneurysm and restoring the blood flow to the normal brain. So if there is a wide neck assistance, the help of a balloon or a stent can be taken so that the coiling can be completed. The other way of treating these aneurysms which are most commonly done in complex aneurysms or surgically not treatable aneurysms include a, a stent placement called flow diverter. This is a highly braided stent which is placed in the arterial wall without entering the aneurysm. So it is a high density stent that prevents the flow of blood into the aneurysm and it redirects the blood flow into the normal vasculature. Over a period of time the aneurysm clots and it completely seals off. It also remodifies the vessel wall which was deceased to begin with and this either the stent or the flow diverter requires the usage of blood thinners called antiplatelets to keep them open on a longer run. So the latest treatment includes something called as endo-oven dead device which is an intracellular flow disruptor where this kind of device is placed within the aneurysm itself that promotes the clotting and uh, without the requirement for the stent and thereby avoiding antiplatelets. So, Certain aneurysms can be treated better with endovascular methods and certain aneurysms are treated by traditional clipping methods. It is always a team decision and the best outcome of the patient is kept in mind. With the advance in neuro interventions, neuro interventions are relatively safer with shorter recovery time and the efficacy of the procedure complication rate is very less.